How's everyone doing? Mask here, and I'm basically going to live record my first attempt at Pegasus level 50. Obviously not something we get to just repeat, try again and again, and I'm not 100% sure if this is going to be my finalized deck. Uh, it's very similar to my deck to farm a Shizu. I was looking through a couple different options. I've seen uh, Rurushin has a great, uh, a great idea out. Unfortunately, he's not going to be able to record... Uh, his final take on it. I'll probably, uh, I'll definitely try out his deck at least once. But uh, I figured Pegasus' entire lineup is spellcasters, very similar to a Shizu. So I'm kind of going very a Shizu esque with this deck. It is extremely similar to the deck I choose to use to farm a Shizu with. It, uh, I, from what I can see on paper, it should do, ve should do fairly well. Uh, we're, we're just gonna go ahead and try it out, to be honest, and uh, see how it goes. We got Pegasus level 50 here. And uh, there's nothing to it but to try it out. My Relinquish deck. Let's go. So I've heard he doesn't... We don't have to worry about Toon World because he doesn't have the Toon World skill. Uh, I think I've heard that it's Balance. We'll have to find that out in just a moment. Holy Guard. Balance. Okay, so they're, yeah, they, they are giving him balance, getting or well rounding his hand. It actually is almost guarantees him to open up with relinquish. That's what balance will end up doing for him. Now the really cool thing here is this deck is going to revolve around unhappy girl, of course, and ready for intercept. Now ready for intercept almost single handedly counters relinquished, which is really nice. Wonder wand. He still should not attack the unhappy girl. Oh, he's going to cycle. Interesting. I guess that's going to power. Our power achieve the relinquish. That's probably the one of the goals of the deck. Now, Magician Circle, of course, will set us up for getting a spare unhappy girl on the field, which is what we we'll, what we pretty much want to do. But um, I don't really want to hit him in, or damage his life points because it's going to force me to get lower quicker. Copycat's definitely not a threat. We pretty much never kill his monsters, but therefore bypassing the threat that is. Uh, bypassing the threat that is or, uh, M Mitchizer. So we'll have to see who he... Okay, so he's going to get out Toon Gemini Elf, which is good. As far as I'm concerned, the, the faster we clog their field, the better. Giving them the least amount of options and uh, limiting the fact that we, ha we have to... Oh, I should have just left him, apparently. Limiting the fact that we... Oh, there's Skull there. Uh, yeah, there you go. We shouldn't have killed that monster to to, uh, to avoid the the risk, the uh, threat that is Skull there. Going to attack now too. Um, he doesn't have lethal though, as far as I can tell. 19 into 14. Now, does this mean Pegasus has level 50 Pegasus has been recoded on Unhappy Girl? Because this doesn't add up math wise. Well, I guess I'll I need to stop it from happening. So I will uh, ready for intercepting. Okay. We pulled a, pulled a second backup girl. Second backup girl. Unhappy girl. Uh, Skull Lair is a huge threat to us. He's going to discard monsters as the game progresses, and he will pop Skull Lair off. We're only running one Twister. We may have to consider running a second one. And uh, we lost our ready for intercepting there, as, of course, as well. Meaning we are not going to be able to counter this Relinquish Summon. So he will steal one of our unhappy girls, and we'll have to see. He'll probably just go complete go ham. Yeah, no. Oh, it's the discard that he's after with the Gemini Elf. That's why he'll probably uh, play around our typical unhappy girl immunity rules. Uh, with Magician's Circle, we won't be able to activate it, so I can't play it. Um, prioritize locking down. No, that was a terrible idea. No! Okay, well, obviously that was just a complete fail straight into Relinquished, and this is going to end the game now. I still think this deck has, uh, definitely has potential. Uh, the problem with it is... Uh, Toon Gemini Elf, but Toon Gemini Elf still can't attack on the turn it's summoned, right? 
It was only because of Skull Lair that we were able to, um, he was even able to switch things up. can't really avoid him getting monsters in the graveyard. It will happen constantly because of Skull Lair. Well, it looks like we're going to have to go back to the drawing board. This was our first attempt on level 50 Pegasus. I'm not giving up on this. I might run something very similar to this for my second attempt, but uh, we are going to be going live. But if, you, if you're watching this video, that means I'm most likely currently streaming. We're going live as soon as I have this done processing and uploading, and we'll be talking over uh, just how we feel like taking the dire taking the, a direction with this level 50 Pegasus deck. As well as, uh, one of my goals today is just to create a giant pool of options to farm Pegasus at level 40 as well. For people who aren't able to build one of the decks I make. I want there to be a couple options. I want to kind of put them all together. But, uh, thanks for watching guys. It didn't go quite as anywhere near as well as I wanted it to. But we're going to work on that. Uh, check us out on twitch.tv slash And uh, don't forget, stay classy.